Hey, what's up guys? Alex here with a new video, and today I wanna to talk about the perfect film camera, the Leica MP. If you're new to the channel, I am a portrait photographer based out of Miami, Florida, and I primarily shoot with Leica and Sony. A lot of the things I'm about to say about this camera, you're gonna be able to say, Alex, any film camera can do that. That is true. When you think about film cameras as a whole, Film is your sensor. So Kodak Portrait 400 on a Nikon, on a Canon, on a Minolta will look the same on a Leica. The one thing the Leica changes or any camera changes with film is the shooting experience and how it makes you feel. Surprisingly, the Leica MP makes me feel something I just don't feel with any other camera. And I'll be very honest with you. I purchased this camera for the first time two years ago and I sold it after a few months. After I sold it, I immediately regretted it. And there's something just about this camera. As a matter of fact, Matt Day posted something on Instagram today. And when he posted it, like it sounds insane, but I couldn't agree with him more. He actually asked a question if people find it easier to nail focus on a film like other than they do on a digital. And when he said that, I automatically just thought to myself, that's how I feel about the Leica MP. When I'm taking pictures with the MP, for some reason, I feel like I nail focus more accurately. It's easier to nail focus. I don't know why it's the same viewfinder on a digital Leica. It might be that film is a little bit more forgiving, but I feel like I nail focus more and I have a more enjoyable focusing experience. And I can't quite figure out why. And that kind of goes into the second thing I love about this camera, and it's just the viewfinder and the experience. I took this camera to Italy, and I use it as my main film body along with a Leica Q3. And I do have to admit, when my wife and I travel and we take pictures of each other or of us, we take a lot of pictures. With a digital camera, we could probably take over 50 images to get that perfect shot. I hate to admit it, but it's the reality. There was moments in Europe where I just pulled out my MP, took a snapshot, felt good about it, and that was it. I was living in the moment. And because I wasn't seeing through the lens, I was seeing through the viewfinder, unlike an SLR where you're actually seeing through the lens, it doesn't feel, you don't feel disconnected. You feel like you're still within that moment. And it's just this weird psychological thing where I was at peace just going up taking my picture and walking away. Again, that's a film thing, right? You can't review your pictures. You can't make sure you got that perfect shot, but it's also about the experience of the viewfinder on the Leica MP. When we got back from Italy, I'll be posting up some of those pictures. Some of my favorite pictures were with the MP and there was no chimping, there was no double takes. It was just capturing that moment at that time. I also love how this camera feels. It feels like a tank. It feels like it's gonna last forever. And it kind of goes back to it. When you enjoy the tool that you're using, because these cameras are tools, when you enjoy how it feels in the hand, when you enjoy how it sounds, how it operates, you want to gravitate and you want to use it more. And that's what the Leica MP provides. For me also, I love the fact that it really has no logos or styling. Now, a lot of people are gonna say that Leicas draw attention and that people know what the red dot is. And to be honest, I'm gonna say that's BS. I have yet to go anywhere and people say, oh, hey, that's a nice Leica. Every time someone sees me with an MP, everybody thinks I'm holding a vintage camera or a retro looking camera. As a matter of fact, some people have come up to me and I've been surprised that it's film and don't even know what film is. Now, yes, that is a younger generation, but it has happened. Very rarely has anybody gotten up to me and said, hey, nice Leica. Or, hey, that's a Leica. That doesn't happen. As a matter of fact, I think Leica isn't as well known amongst uh, non-photographers. So does this camera grab attention? Absolutely not. I think also to add to that, the silver body. I personally love a silver Leica. It just looks incredible to me. People will say that the black camera is stealthier. I call BS on that too. If you have a camera in your face, whether it's black, silver, pink, blue, green, you have a camera in your face. People are gonna see it. There's no such thing as, oh, it's black. 
people can't see me. I don't buy that whatsoever, right? So I personally love the silver. I don't think it grabs any more attention than the black one does. And overall, it's just a gorgeous, gorgeous camera. But back to it, this is my favorite film camera of all time. And when I go through my journey, when I sold my Leica MP, I actually tried a few film cameras with autofocus because I was trying to get a better hit rate. And I realized that AF on film cameras isn't the greatest. So now that I've had my second go around with a Leica MP and I've gotten way better with a rangefinder and that my accuracy has improved a lot, I'm getting a better hit rate with focus accuracy on this MP than I did on like a Nikon F100, which is a fully automatic film camera by Nikon. And that's important because with the prices of film these days, the last thing you want is a bunch of frames that are out of focus. The light meter on this camera is also incredible. I don't use an external light meter. I trust the camera. And there was not a single shot. As a matter of fact, out of the 10 rolls I've put through it so far, there hasn't been a single shot that's been under or overexposed that wasn't on purpose. And that's really, really impressive. But in the end, I connect with this camera. I love the shooting experience. I love how it makes me feel and it's made me shoot more film. So when you think about a film like a, whether it's like an M6, MP, M4P, MP, or even MA without the light meter, these cameras make you feel different. They're not gonna make you a better photographer. They're gonna actually challenge you to become a better photographer. They're gonna challenge you to really work on your composition. It's a lot more difficult to frame a shot without seeing the lens or through the lens and just seeing frame lines. But those little challenges connect you more to the shooting experience and I firmly believe over time make you a better photographer. So hopefully you enjoyed this video on the Leica MP, my favorite film camera of all time. Let me know your thoughts in the comments as always. What is your favorite film camera? Let's have a discussion and I will see you on the next one. Have a good one guys. Peace.